When you thought you heard everything, I'm here to let you know you really didn't. This story came out in HuffPost, September 14th, 2018. Arizona man faked Down syndrome and hired caregivers to change his diapers, police. (laughs) All these people are crazy as hell. (laughs) We have been hoodwinked, y'all. We've been hoodwinked all over the earth. (laughs) The suspect, Paul Anthony Menchaca, pretended to be a woman hiring nannies to bathe and change the diapers of an adult son. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, let's listen to this story. I think it, I can just... But we start with an ABC 15 exclusive, the story already disturbing enough. But when you learn what one guy did for a living, it will have you shaking your head in disgust. A valley man accused of faking an illness and hiring caregivers to bathe him and change his diapers. Turns out the guy was also a school crossing guard at the time. ABC 15, Sonu Wasu joining us live. And Sonu, you're hearing exclusively from the innocent victims in all of this. That's right. These victims are disgusted. They are shocked and they want to know why someone would go to such extremes to fool caregivers. Now we are live outside Bogle Junior High School here in Chandler where the suspect worked as a crossing guard. The school officials tell me there were no red flags. He passed all of the background checks and no problems at all while he worked here. What's your full name and date of birth? My name's Paul Anthony Menchaca. Paul Anthony Menchaca appears soft-spoken in front of a judge, but the man caregivers who worked with him saw was very different. He acts like a child. His whole demeanor was childlike-minded, so he would have tantrums, he would talk like a child, he would act like a child. This caregiver met Menchaca through an app called CareLinks. She was hired to keep him company during the day, change his diapers, bathe him, because he had Down syndrome. The victim says she noticed he was aroused and acted strangely while changing his diaper. He would just be clapping, he would be smiling, he would be talking to us when we were changing his diaper. Another caregiver says the Menchaca she met pretended to have a traumatic brain injury. He did ask me a few times to come over and help him shower, but I wasn't incredibly comfortable with that. Now police say it was all an act. It was kind of like a fetish for him, I guess you can say. The experience has traumatized the victims who showed up to care for Menchaca, all women who genuinely are in this to help vulnerable adults. I'm glad I never showered him, and he's going to get what you know he deserves for fooling everybody like this. Also fooled school administrators who trusted him in and out of the classroom here in Chandler. We're told Menchaca has resigned from his position as a crossing guard. In Chandler, Sonu Basu, ABC 15, Arizona. The victims also warning other caregivers to be careful about who they sign up to care for, especially clients found through apps. Many of them won't conduct background checks, so it's really up to you to protect yourself. Wow. <laughs> so, so, <laughs> so this dude, <laughs> so, <laughs> so this dude right here fake having Down syndrome so that he would have these strange women come over and change his diaper and shower him. (laughs) This man is sick as hell. These people are too sick to run this world. They really are. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell. And I will see you on the next video. This is some crazy shit. Peace, family.